Hey sweethearts, what's up? And welcome back to my channel. <laughs> in today's video, as you can see by the title, I'm gonna be doing a nice little haul and review on none other than Shoe Dazzle, Just Fab. Now, I actually didn't know how to title this video because I realized many years ago um, that Just Fab and Shoe Dazzle actually so tired. And in today's video, I'm exhausted. <laughs> anyway, as you can see by the title, I'm going to be reviewing Shoe Dazzle Just Fab and doing a little haul for you guys. So I got some goodies. Um, I want to dive right into things and I'm super excited. Yeah. Um, a couple years ago, I don't know if you guys know this, but I found this out a couple years ago. Shoe Dazzle and Just Fab actually combined and became one company. They were originally two, and I guess um, there was just too much competition, and they're like, why keep doing this with each other? Like, we're like the same thing. So they came together, and they just merged the companies. Although you can still shop on either site. It's weird though, because I got these at shoedazzle.com, but they came in a just fab box. So I don't know. I guess when they run out of shoe dazzle, they just use their good old buddy just fab. I don't know. I really don't actually know. Um, but anyway, yeah, without further ado, no need for a long introduction. Let's just get right into the video and the shoes. Okay, so I'm going to start with the first pair. I guess I'll do, oh, I can't even choose, like, yeah, I'll do these ones first. <laughs> so the first pair that I'm going to do are apparently from Just That, but I ordered them from Shoe Dazzle, so I don't think it matters. Um, whatever I say is what it is, I guess. I got the flat boot Tilly in bright red, and I am a size 8. They, everything seems pretty true to size. I, again, have been shopping at this website for many, many years. So, um, oh my god. I bought my first pair of shoes on Just Fab like 12 years ago or 13 maybe even that's crazy seems like yesterday ah! oh my god i'm so tired okay the tilly boot in bright red is what i'm going to be opening first i don't have any nails or else i would make this up asmr do you guys want ams <laughs> what is it called Okay, let's just stop that. Maybe I'll do a little tissue paper for you too. Voila! Or should I say? Voila! <laughs> so anyway. Here are the Tilly boots in bright red. Let me put this down. This boot, first of all, I do want to say, you guys. Okay, so I just want to say red boots and purses or accessories are 100% in this fall, um, this fall season, fall, autumn, whatever you call it. And you have to get yourself a pair. You know what? It's funny because I would never do, like, I don't even really wear red, to be honest. And... I was like, I don't know about these. And then I saw girls wearing them in like some of the pictures. And I'm like, oh my God, they're actually really nice and I'm obsessed. And they look like they are gonna be a good color red, which hello, they are. Cause you just never know with some reds to be honest. It is, a, it is definitely a bold look, but I will say red boots are all over the runway this year. So I had to grab myself a pair, of course. Also like country Western style boots, are super in right now. Um, cowboy boots, 
They have made a comeback this year like crazy. I'm seeing them all over the runways, all over Instagram, all over everywhere, basically, you can look. Anywho, quality on these. I haven't worn them out yet. I mean, I filmed a couple of reels in them, which I will be posting this week. But, well, I guess it's Friday if you guys are watching this, so maybe I will be posting those on Monday. I don't know. Um, but yeah, here is the boot. I am a size eight in everything on Just Fab and Shoe Dazzle. Everything is always true to size, which I love, so that's a, definitely a plus. So as you can see, they call this a flat boot, and yeah, I already got a little scuff mark, so whoopsie. I wonder if I can just scrape it off. Oh, I can. Anyway, don't get a scuff mark. They have a little tiny heel. They're, I would consider these a flat boot, honestly, but that to me is not a heel. But um, they do call them flat boots, but this is like a little chunk here. So the quality on these are really good. The color, really good. They even have these like little loopholes, which like regular cowboy boots have. So they make them like very authentic. The inside is like this. I hate the inside on them, to be honest, because it's like that foamy, flammable feeling, but whatever. I mean, they're not expensive shoes. They're totally affordable. So for that, I let that go. Slide. Pick your battles, people, when it comes to fashion. Actually, when it comes to everything in life. So the boot has this beautiful, like, um, what do you call that? Like weaving pattern. What's the word I'm thinking of? I don't know, threading. There's like a beautiful threading and it adds like just like little swirls and lines. I don't know if that's supposed to be flames, but very cowboy boot-like. Um, definitely recommend these, love these, obsessed. And I know I got these for cheap because I'm always getting either a free credit or cashing in my points and getting a lot of money off. So this, boot ran me next to nothing but um if it's your first order then you will get your first pair for $9.99 so make sure you guys do that and sign up um yeah it's a great company really I've had it for I've been a member for years so yeah that is the first boot and then I'm gonna try all these on so I will post at the end the video of me trying them on I will post at the end some video clips and footage of me trying them on going outside in them and all that jazz. So just stay tuned. Or if you don't want to hear me yap, 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 just scroll to the end of the video and you can see the shoes in action. All right, let's move on to the next boot. A bigger box, you guys. <laughs> Okay, you guys, we have a bigger, a little bit of a bigger box this time. So again, saying just fab, even though I bought them on Shoe Dazzle, figure that one out. Same company, don't forget it. Okay, so yeah, I won't do the whole ASMR spiel unless you guys want that. I mean, I'm just saying, let me know. Tell me in the description box below and I will, I mean, I'm willing to do it. I feel like I could do it. I don't know, I feel like it would be good. So let's open these babies up. I do want to say, like, I did, I did mention that cowboy boots are completely in this year. So both of the pairs that I chose are a Western style cowboy like boot. So yeah, this color, I have so many pairs of black boots. I now have a red boot. I have a white boot. I have a gray boot. But I wanted like a cream color or a brown, so I went with these. They are called Bone, and they're a little whiter than cream color, but um, I guess maybe they're not actually. But like you can wear these with brown tones and neutrals, so yeah, these are gonna work out great. Let's get rid of that. Voila! These are my ultimate faves, you guys. One second. Okay. 
I mean, just give that a look. Yeah. I'm obsessed. So it has the same in embroidery. That's the fucking word I was looking for. Light bulb. <laughs> so yeah, they have a, oh, oh, oh. So they have that same embroidered, <laughs> embroidered, is that a word? Yeah, that's a word, embroidered. They have that same embroidered, oh no, got my lip gloss on there. So again, same embroidered flame-like pattern, very Western. You can see the color is, well they, whoa. <laughs> They call this color bone, which makes complete sense because as you can see, it's like an off-white. It's not a white, so you can wear these with like dark browns, light browns, whites. I mean, that's what I love about this boot. So this boot does have a heel and it is a nice thick one, so it keeps things very comfortable. I will say when I bought these ones and tried them on, they run, the red boots are completely true to size, total size eight. These ones feel almost like a seven and, or a seven and a half. So I would say if you're interested in purchasing these boots, go a half size up because they do feel quite snug. They'll probably loosen up, but if you're concerned about sizing for these ones in particular, definitely go a half size up. Wait, what are these ones called? Oh Phoenix boot. Okay, so these are called the Heeled Phoenix boot and in the color Bone. And of course, I'll have everything linked in the description so that you can go shop them now. Uh, but yeah, zipper going halfway up, same as the red boot. So it leaves that room for you to get your leg in. Now, they go super wide, so they're not like um, snug or tight on your calf. If you have larger calves or legs, this is gonna be a great option because they do go so wide um, the further up they go, which I love that style. You know, sometimes we don't want everything completely skin tight. So yeah, this is that boot. I'm obsessed. And then, so I um, got these on a free credit actually, so I think I paid like $7 total for these. I mean, I technically paid the 40, but I forgot I did, I guess, because it's a membership service for those who don't know. But yeah, I wanted to show you guys my real pair of which you've probably seen on my Instagram. If you're following me, by the way, go follow. I am Karina Marie on Instagram and engage in the activity, you guys. Don't just be lurking. That's weird. Let me go get my black cowboy boots because those are actual real cowboy boots. I got them in Phoenix, Arizona a few years ago when COVID hit actually, I think. Yeah, because I went out to Arizona because they were not shut down. <laughs> um, and I think I got those ones at the boot barn and I love them and they're crazy good quality. So they are a huge difference to these, but these are more for fashion and those are more like a real friggin' deal. So the inside of the black ones I'm gonna show you is not that like foam, like cheap material, but I mean, we're talking about a pair of $200 boots to a pair of 30, $40 boots. So can't go wrong, but I will show you quickly. Woo, I'm excited. Now I have so many cowboy boots. <laughs> so these are my real cowboy boots. I mean, you can already see the difference. like. These are real leather, these are not, but they have that same embroidered pattern. This boot is just clearly much better quality. But I mean, in terms of like looking the same, I mean, wow, why does this one look so small compared to that one? These are stunning. Same embroidery, there's no zipper on these ones, they're just a slide in. I guess the heel is like bigger than the red one, but smaller than, the bone colored boot. Um, and then inside, made in Mexico, okay. So it's all upper leather in here. As you can see, that's like what you wanna see in a boot. That's the real deal. So can't go wrong, but Boot Barn, definitely go there, you guys. They always have sales too. And I think they do like a points program where 
you buy a couple pairs of boots and then you get a free pair. I don't know. But I don't think, I don't know that I'll ever go back there. Not for any bad reasons. I just clearly have enough boots now. <laughs> I guess that's it for this video. Um, let's just skip to the montage of me wearing the boots. Why don't we? So I know you guys don't want to hear me chitter chatter anymore. Or maybe you do. Let me know. I could tell you some more fun stories. Um, I have a lot. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, without further ado, let's get right into the montage, the try on, and let's get outside and wear these boots. Here we go. that little montage I put together and if you love the boots as much as I do do not hesitate to click those links down below and go shop go create your profile and um, get yourself some fashionable fun trending boots for the right price without breaking the bank I hope everyone is having a great week I hope everyone had a great week I know mine was very rough that's why I am here Thursday night quickly filming this video so it can be up for Friday at 5 p.m. Like I promised, so you guys can watch and continue watching, continue supporting. I appreciate it so much. Every like, every comment, every, all of it counts. So keep it up and um, let's continue growing this channel. Don't forget you guys, let me know in the comment box below what types of videos you wanna see more of and uh, what brands you want me to review next. And um, yeah. Also, let me know in the comment box below, what was your favorite boot? Would you, are you more, are you more inclined to go for the red one or the bone? Which one? And what do you guys think about red boots? That's what I wanna know. Cause I was a little like unsure and iffy at first, but now I'm like, that was the right decision for sure. So yeah. I hope you guys were able to see me this whole time. Maybe I should have. No, I shouldn't have done that. Okay, well, I hope you can. <laughs> so, yes, thank you guys so much for watching. Now I'm speaking in an accent. I don't know why, but I am. So we're just going to go with it. Um, yes, sweethearts, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that bell button to get notified every time I upload and to post so you don't miss a single video. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button if you enjoyed this video and also leave a comment, like, comment, share, subscribe and hit the bell button. And now I'm back to being an American citizen, hopefully soon. <laughs> it's been a week, you guys, I'm exhausted. I'm probably going to try to edit this up and go to sleep and wake up and go through the madness of life again. So remember you guys, stay positive, stay calm, stay neutral, stay loving and stay in your, and stay in your era of love and light and self-development. Don't stop growing. Remember when you're going through difficult times, it is a preparation for something great 
and any negative or bad thing that happens is a chance to learn and grow. Don't ever forget that. And remember, if the, keeps, if the same situation keeps being recycled to you and you keep experiencing the same things again and again, year after year, it's because you need to change something upstairs. So yeah, change the way you think, change the way you do things, and then your life will start to change. Obviously, easier said than done. Maybe I'll do another little motivation and detachment video sometime in the near future. Um, but until then, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you next Friday. Thanks so much for watching. Bye, sweethearts.